Well, if that wasn't all a bit of a much of a muchness and all that kind of nonsense, hello, welcome to the stream. It is day two of our lovely week here at Frontier Development's headquarters of town. Uh, we are on our way to um, Sol, all the way from Beagle Point. Biscuit time. Sorry I'm late. Was I late? A wizard is never late, nor is he ever early. He arrives precisely when he means to. And the same goes for me and other people. Hello. Yes, the sneaky moo at the back um, is, I worked out, is Muzipan himself, the man who did the lovely piece of artwork. So we do have to say thank you very much to him. I feel like it's a slightly older version of me uh, with a sort of bit more facial hair. It's like when I've got a bit more growth on top of the old noggin. But uh, it's pretty good. Uh, Package arrived in the UK from Germany, Mr. Red says, Mr. Dog, what are you talking about? My dog, are you? You don't live in Germany, do you? You've gone mad. I really... I know, Shan, I heard that you can now plot a route all the way home. Is that right? Like, actually 60,000 light years? Is that even supposed to be a thing? I'm not even sure if that's supposed to be a thing. Good to see you all here, though, and it was lovely to see you all here, even in this chat, even going, oh, this is lovely, like, nice, um, nice people. Hello, Tolagarf, how are you? I don't think I even, uh, oh, I did. It's a surprise head. Oh, interesting, all right, okay. Oh, this is nerve-wracking. Uh, the plot in this morning doesn't work, says Grief. Okay, well, that seems interesting. So, everybody, thank you very much for turning up. Um, you guys are the loveliest, bestest people in the world. Um, but you already know that, I don't have to tell you that. Uh, what's happening here? I feel like this star must be huge. Very nervous about heading around these stars, but I need to do a good old haul here of Le Fuel. So stop, stop, stop. And let's talk a little bit about this absolutely lovely little bit of uh, uh, artwork here done by Muzipan. The guy has added himself to Twitter as well, and he's just tweeted at me or replied to a tweet about, about it. So do go over there and have a look and follow him and tell him congratulations on how lovely it is. And does everyone remember Shiny Ted? The little bear on the left, he's the guy that Steve Kirby made me, that little bear, over at the Christmas live stream. And he added this little guy, it's such a lovely little touch. And you've got the ants coming over to the biscuits, uh, and an apple always, and a thermos flask. Who knows what's in the thermos flask? Probably something to have um, uh, for during when the FSD fails and we have to take a, a shot of that. But yeah, I just think it's so nice, like so lovely, so nicely done. And of course the Asp Scout in the background as well just looks perfect. Apparently, originally he was gonna have it so it was a crashed Asp Scout, but he was like, no, after watching the streams, I want you to succeed, so I'm gonna give you a, <coughs> I'm gonna give you a positive on that. Uh, yeah, awesome, and there's a cow at the back, but I think it might be Muzipan, the guy who actually did the things, because he's used it as his, his piece, his little piece. Is Muzipan in the chat? Oh, he's there! Hey! Hey, Muzipan, how's it going? There's not much more to follow my Twitter for now, though. You should definitely follow him, because I'm sure that in future he'll be putting up lots of cool images and stuff like that. So that's a, a German commander as well. Is that right, Muzipan? Interviews with Muzipan today on the live stream. How many friends do I have on which account? This account that I'm on now? Or, oh, this account. Uh, they literally, the account I'm playing right now, sorry. Uh, someone stole your name? Oh, no. It's good to see you. Yes, no, the, um, I think that the point of the, the picnic is that I've made it all the way back. Shiny Ted and I are having a nice little picnic to celebrate arriving home with the favorite biscuits. But I did see a Jammy Dodger on there, and as, as we know, the Jammy Dodgers are low on the scale of things. But yeah, I really do appreciate it, uh, David and Muzipan. You, it's an absolutely amazing little image. Absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. I hope you don't mind what I've done with it as well, adding the little, uh, adding the text on there and stuff. I hope you don't mind that. I thought it fits really quite, it fits quite nicely. I want your artistic opinion on that too, if possible. Hello, arms like noodles. Hello. These are my arms like noodles. Uh, yeah, coots. Good to see you. Of course, the assistant producer of the uh, assistant producer of the live stream. Griefed, of course, is in here. Uh, Pleppy, Shan, the mug coordinator. Andrea Kitty, how are you? Official idiot, I think you nominated yourself as. 
artist, of course, um, who's a panfishal artist for the live stream. I need to put the credit on. I'm sorry, I've, I'm going to do that. I'm going to put the credit in the description as well. Of course, a huge credit to you. And I'll link people to your Twitter and things like that, just in case. Uh, and I don't know. Other stuff. Oh, Fire Toad as well. And yeah. yeah, I hope Mutaman gets lots of work now. <laughs> I hope lots of people ask him for things. But yeah, he's a proper artist though, so you do have to be nice to him. Yeah, you know what I mean by nice. Andy FM has Andy FM. Sorry, yes, Andy FM, the official barman of the stream, has the special bottle brought in for today's gathering, ready for any FSD issues. I'm hoping that we don't have any FSD issues. Uh, I'm still at four, 54 percent, was it? Oh, I'm jumping too late. No, hopefully not too many FSD issues. Oh, hopefully not too many. Uh, too many. Yeah, you want something for us? A dr proper us a drunk lots? I don't know. Ask him. He's here. He's here to ask, answer any of your questions on today's live stream. So if you are unaware of what this live stream is about, uh, you are here for some reason. I gamer, good to see you. Uh, for some reason, for the first time ever, you've joined us today. Well, I'm going to be reviewing a biscuit at the end of the live stream. But of course, before that, I have to make my way all the way back to Sol. Um, I keep starting these things late because of real work issues and things like that. So I do apologize about that. Um, but eventually we'll be making our way back 60,000 light years all the way to Sol from Beagle Point. I'm still 60,000 light years out. We've done less than 5,000 in two weeks. This is the third week of doing this. So I might have to start doing some at home, but I also want people's opinions on that, whether they mind it just taking absolutely ages. We can just talk about nonsense and things like that. I don't know. But tomorrow is Wednesday, and of course you know what that means. It's Guest Wednesday. Guest Wednesday, everybody. Who will be the guest on Guest Wednesday? Guest, we have we bring on a guest from Frontier Developments, a because um, I'm lucky enough to actually be streaming from the office from Frontier Developments. Bring on a guest to uh, uh, you watch the VODs. Madness, madness. Psycho Car, the lovely Psycho Car. Thank you so much, by the way, for sorting out my uh, hut and mug, which disaster struck yesterday. Within less than 24 hours, uh, a replacement mug arrived for the hut and mug to sit atop the pyramid, the, the, the pyramid of shambolicness. Wow, guess the guess. Guess who? Guess who? I like it. We could do that. We could do guess who and have them off camera and I can do trick questions and then eventually we bring the guest on. That'd be a lot of fun, wouldn't it? So many, so many good ideas in our lovely friendly live stream chat. Hey Earlsgriff79, thank you very much for joining us today. Is this your first time here on the stream? Something fishy today. Yeah, there is something fishy today, actually. Yeah, something a little, something a little fishy going on on the beta. Uh, I would love a Thargoid and Ferdinand's mug. I don't think I have one. I think it's one of the very few that I've got. I haven't got. Space Madness saying a long time ago. Yesterday we had Ian on the stream. Ian from the Bake Off. He didn't tweet back at me though. Look at my hair, it's actually shimmering. For once it is actually shiny. But I'm worried, I'm a bit worried guys. Uh, we now have um, sort of 40 people viewing. And uh, we had that, that great stream last week when we had 111 people watching me eat a custard cream. The legendary custard cream episode as it has become known in uh, Inner Circles. And uh, I was... I was worried about it because now that we've got that and some actual really nice stream artwork, uh, we're becoming almost too professional. So we need to knock it down a few pegs. Um, so what do you suggest I do to make it a little less, a little less good, and a little bit more rubbish? We haven't had any USB problems today. I did start 15 minutes late, so that kind of rounds it up. Commander Coots, do you have any suggestions for how we can make it a little bit worse? He isn't around, that's also quite worrying. Zach is the official saboteur, frontier dev. He doesn't seem to be here today though. I think he's behaving because he knew how, how much of a struggle it was me for, for me to get started today. All right, let's go back to here. I haven't had any FSD drives yet, so we can't. Can't, uh, you can't pour any shots for anyone yet. 
Andy. Alex, Alex, Alex is here. He's ready. He's ready for topless Wednesdays tomorrow on the stream. <laughs> that is the best suggestion we've we've had so far. Thank you, Alex. It's not going to happen though. We've got guest Wednesdays. Sorry, Alex. <laughs> topless Wednesdays is the worst idea. Altistic, good to see you. Thank you very much. Frontier Dev's back. Hello, Frontier Dev. How are you today? Are you, how are you? How are you operating? So we had a bit of a late start today, so I'm really, really sorry about that. But Alex, did you see? I always want to just like I don't know why it's Alex. Alex is like the official adjudicator of the streams. Just to come on and make sure that the quality is still high. Uh, I feel like he's maybe still still producing me from afar, from back in the Gamescom day, almost a year ago now. Uh, did you see? Did you see the uh, the lovely bit of artwork that um, has been done for the stream? I'm going to show it up really, really quickly. Got this one as well, so this is a bit of a spoiler. Back soon one, making a brew. And then a little thanks for watching one. Oh, that's slightly up. There you go. How lovely are those? Can't get enough of those today. I'm so excited. Uh, yeah, 48, 48 views is all right as a, for a Tuesday's live stream. We usually build towards the end of the week. But then around about quarter two, of course, things pick up for the biscuit review segment of the live stream. Um, as much, it's usually when I leave the stream to go and get my cup of tea that more people turn up, which is, and then people talk about me behind my back and make me feel like I'm making mistakes and making uh, on the live stream. So, yeah. Am I wearing a prison space suit? I'm wearing, if you call an elite day, oh, it's all tingly. No, it's just my standard. Oh, am I wearing a prison space suit in the artwork? Um, I think it's just like a classic uh, space suit. Needs animating for early days. <laughs> yeah. Bewildered Beast, we cannot buy. This is the sort of thing that you have to ask. I will never make any money from this. This is not something that I want to make money for. But if you ask. Uh, make money from, but if you ask what's his name, um, Muzapan, maybe he'd set up a little store with some artwork on there and he can make some money from it. I would much rather that was the case than, than anyone's buying mugs from me anyway, that's for sure. This is a non profit organization here, it's a charity. Free mugs for everyone! Not free mugs for everyone, nobody's getting a free mug. I'm very, very sorry. <laughs> Zach attacks the commission detected, yeah, absolutely. So how has everyone been? I honestly, no details. All the details are going to be hidden away. But um, as in, I'm not allowed to, I can't possibly um, getting money from mugging people sounds good. <laughs> yes. And he's smart too, and he's witty as well. Uh, but basically, yeah, on my journey here today with uh, things getting in the way, I'm not going to make any, gonna any details out, but I had a bit of a nightmare here arriving at today's stream. So I'm a bit flustered if you haven't noticed. Um, so I do apologize. If anyone can give me a hug through the internet, that would be very lovely. And just a, maybe just a little sort of patronizing pat on the head and um, a pinch of the cheek from Mad Dog would make me feel much better today. Cheers. I'm just going to do the rest of the stream like this. And then, and then, and then it, I think it's art. I think that's what this is, it's art. Artistic. Um, yes, thank you for the hug. Thank you for the sword hugs. Uh, thank you, hug. Arms like noodles. He's got to go back to work. Oh, oh no, he bits. He pats me in the head. For, oh no, he glumps. I don't know what glumps is. Does anyone know what a glomp is? It sounds a little bit um, devious. My dog a hug. I don't have a dog. He's a he's a shiny Ted. Is um he's a polar bear. Thank you very much. Oh, is there a 2.1 update happening right now? That's, that's interesting. 
performance art. Do you like the performance art? Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the performance art, everybody. As that was today's performance art. And next we're moving on to uh, jumping and more jumping and more jumping. So, yeah, you can get easy, easy to... What? I, have a do I do have a dog. But he's the he's also the film wizard, so I'm not really sure what's going on. So does anyone have anything new to tell me about life? About, you know, meaning of life? Why we're really here? What we're really here for? Who we are? If we are? Why are we are? Why are, why, are, why are we here? Super one beat patching right now, that's awesome. Commander Coots resigned from his job, everybody. It's because he's officially becoming full-time um, assistant producer of the live stream. That's crazy. Why are you doing that? Does anyone want to give Commander Coots a job? He is currently, assistant producer Coots in the chat is currently unemployed and it would be very useful if we were to make sure that he can still keep doing silly things at lunch times like this rather than going to a proper job. So if we can help him, yeah. Upgrade button's currently disabled, that's a real shame. Oh, I really hope that the new Radiohead albums are all the answers, and I think it will. I mean, in the past, Radiohead have had some good answers for us uh, with their previous output, so I'm hoping that they do too as well here. Uh, Darks, Mac, you're here for the hair? What kind of hair, this hair? Put it there then. Like that. Welcome to the live stream. This is the hair stream. Um, if someone can put some little googly eyes on the hair, that would be nice. Eyebrows. Don't study the eyebrows too much. I can talk with my. I can talk with my eyebrows. Like this. Hello. Welcome to the live stream. How are you doing? That's enough of that silliness. Too silly. Too silly. Too silly now. You've you've been too silly. Go small in the corner. Well. You <clears throat> Coots can be assistant to the producer, which is a clear promotion for assistant producer. That's true. Is it true? Assistant to the producer. No more. Sorry. <laughs> I haven't lost the plot. I promise, Mr. Junks, I have not lost the plot. I'm just trying to have a little bit of fun on my lunch break while other people watch me do that, which is a little odd, but it's great. Let's do this. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of this hellhole. It's a rubbish system. Let's find out if it's a rubbish system first. Tiny little Ed has been far too rude. He's been silly, so he's sitting in the corner where he can't, he can't be silly any longer. No, it's okay. He can come back now. Votes. Tiny Ed to stay or Tiny Ed? Should I stay or should I go, Tiny Ed? Eddie in my pocket, <laughs> as cute as can be. Even smaller, I think. I'm still here. I'm still here. Hello. Can anyone hear me? I'm still here. I'm still, I'm down here. They, they, they do keep coming, yes. The jokes are thick and fast. What I can do is I'll sit up here on this heat bar up here. <laughs> hey! <laughs> wow, it's hot. It's hot up here. It's 65 degrees. 65% on degrees. That would be ridiculous. Oh, he's gone. Oh, that's no fun anymore. Sorry, uh, there you go. If you're gonna give me silly tools to play around with, XSplit, then I'm gonna be silly with them, aren't I? I'm gonna be messing around with these silly things, okay? I'm still here, I'm still, I'm still existing. Don't forget the cheese grommet, Ed Grin. That did exist, yes. He's my favorite, Wallace and Gromit. They're my faves. Hair today gone tomorrow. Much hairdo about nothing. Any more hair puns that we can get in here? would be uh, tremendous today. Make me feel a lot better about uh, what happened just before the live stream, which will forever remain a mystery to you all. But it involved you all without you even knowing it. I'm 
let that be. Uh, let, letting that be a lesson to you, without you even knowing what that lesson was, let, you, let it be known that you learnt a lesson today, everybody. We all learnt a lesson today, and you learnt it, I learnt it, we all learnt it together. Uh, too much Red Bull, I've not had any Red Bull today, yeah, but I think it's the lack of Red Bull, oh, the, the lack of tea. So that's, it's lucky that we're going to be making a brew in just a moment's time. Five minutes time, and it's time for the brisket review of the day. What could that biscuit be? Who knows? We're about to find out. It's just one biscuit today. Yesterday we had a very special biscuit where we had two biscuits in a row. One of them was, and it turns out I, I named the cookie, the, uh, the Steve Kirby's biscuit incorrectly because uh, of the chips in there. It had a very specific name. But my gosh, that was a nice, nice homemade biscuit. Very, very good home, first homemade biscuit to add to the roster. I uh, haven't had time to update the, the list just yet, but I will get around to that eventually. So let's see if we can do sort of another five or six jumps first before we go and start the biscuit reviews because I did start late today. Uh, and then tomorrow, because of today's lateness, I'm gonna see if I can start a few minutes early Ooh, to make up for my lunchtime because technically it means that my lunchtime was used up. It is not a Garibaldi, Osric 42. It is not a Bourbon, let, but let it be known, Bourbons are some of my favorite biscuits. Hyper DI asks, what is Beagle Point? Beagle Point is a point across from the, all the way to the side of the galaxy, which was 65,000 light years away from Sol. So if you are a player of Elite Dangerous, you'll know how long that takes to get to. And I legitimately made all the jumps all the way out there um, and then did a live stream where I made the final approach. And I thought, you know what? Well, that was fun. I'm going to be doing it on my lunch breaks to get home anyway, doing the jumps to get back home. So I thought, why don't I do it on a live stream? People can watch. And then I can add a little silly little silly twist to the end where I review a biscuit, and that is what has happened here. Uh, that's what Beagle Point is. Any more explanations about Beagle Point? It isn't a doggy biscuit today, it's not Tim Tam today, it's not Kit Kat, it's not Rich Tea. Rich Tea has already been done, Summer 1540. Um, I will show you the current standing on the spreadsheet in a little while. No, Cess three ab one school want. You have not missed the biscuit review. Don't worry, the biscuit review will be starting in about five minutes time. Jumping home for live con. Do do do. Can someone fill me in with the next line? And hopefully I'll be making it back in time for LaveCon, and if I do, then we will be doing a live, live, live stream from LaveCon where we do the jumping, the last few jumps. Not an Oreo, although an Oreo one is a good one, an Oreo is a good one. It's not Seabiscuit, the horse, the, the racehorse, it's not a racehorse, I'm not eating a racehorse. Although I am so hungry that I could eat a so I'm pretty hungry right now. Doggy biscuit will happen at some point because it is a biscuit, and if it's a biscuit, then it, then it counts. No biscuits is off limits with a Z. We had digestive already, true, but did we have the variant? Of the digestive. Hmm, there's a sneaky little hint. It's not Limp Biscuit, it is not Fred Durst. Although I did once see at TwitchCon Fred Durst playing Gang Beasts, the game Gang Beasts. It was me, and I was on the front row of this, it wasn't even the front row, it was the beanbag area, and I just heard this voice and people going, haha, Fred, you're amazing at this. And I looked up and I was like, is Fred Durst from Limp Biscuit playing Gang Beasts in front of a crowd of about 10 people who definitely didn't really understand quite who he was? It was a very uh, interesting time for us all. Osric42, have I got a treat in store for you? If you're excited by the dark chocolate biscuit, digestive biscuit, then you have got an exciting next 15 minutes lined up for you. Raunchy, a ra unadulterated. Action, hot, top. It's 
Topless Tuesdays. It's not Topless Tuesdays, and that will never be a thing. Even though Alex, Alex, Alex said it should be, it'll never be a thing. I promise. Do I do a dunk test? Oh, just you wait and see Simmer 1540. Is this your first biscuit review? Oh, stick around. You are in for a treat too. Dark Chocolate Hobnob will come along at some point soon. Yes. Um, there are no worries there. Right, okay, it's now quarter two. Oh, today's stream was was intense and short, um, but I feel like we, we've made some progress here, certainly. Uh, we've made, I reckon, a few hundred light years, but, which isn't incredible, but it is certainly enough. Enough. All right, let's line up to the next destination. And I'm going to mute, and of course, you know how this works, everybody at home. Chat amongst yourselves. It's like the school disco, as we weren't yesterday, that no one will actually chat. But chat amongst yourselves, have a nice time. I'm going to mute and go back to my new fancy back soon screen. New fancy back We knew, we knew, we knew it was Zach. What? Let me show you what he's done to my screen. Look at this. He has removed <laughs> the numbers from the keyboard and left me with this. 
and you can't see that because of the, the thing. Hold on, let me see if I can get that. Just really, really quickly, sorry to break the... In case of emergency, use this. What a swine! What a swine! <laughs> Why did I give him the job? Why did I give him the job? Anyway, here we go. Let's see what I can do. I think I can press buttons with the pen. Is that what he's... Is that what he means? Yeah, I think I can, so... Yes! I can still press buttons. I just have to use the pen as to press in the middle. Thank you very much, Zach, for that hilarious, wonderful addition to the... the live stream. I literally saw him scampering away with a grin on his face as I, as I turned up. Ridiculous. Right, okay, so... Let's do this. Here it is. All right, today's biscuit, of course, without further ado, is the wonderful, the amazing Sainsbury's Sweet Meal Digestive Biscuit with dark chocolate. Dark chocolate, chocolate noir. There you go. So I'm thinking of revenge. It's just every single time. It's like, how do we get to the point where he's not going to do it anymore? What are we going to do? He's going to keep going forever. Uh, I'm so speckly, aren't I? Let's see if I can sort that out. Do, 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 do. I like this sort of live learning. There we go. Okay, slightly less speckly now. That's good. All right. So, of course, as we can see, let's add it first of all to the thing. I can still type. He hasn't taken away that from me. He's taken the C away. <laughs> yeah, and then... Dark... C... <laughs> Cho chocolate. There we go. He likes, to he likes to slow things down for me so then I can't get proper work done. Let's see, see how he feels when we don't get all everything out that needs to get out. Thank you very much for joining us. Here we go. Um, I'm gonna, I, should lock, I should start locking that door, shouldn't I? That, that way you'll never get past me. All right, so let's have a go. First of all, as we know, wow, we've done 12 biscuits now. This is the 12th biscuit. How good is that? So I feel good about that. I feel excited about that. All right, let's do this. Mm. So, appearance. A very good... Very good standard looking biscuit. I mean, the digestive biscuit is 6.5. This has got seven, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six. No, wait, hold on. Seven? <laughs> oh no! It's gonna change the scenes as I do it as well. Right, okay, um, and then we've got taste. Here we go, first biscuit, first taste, first taste, you ready? Mmm. 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 Do a little bit of dark chocolate. It gets quite crummy, quite messy. Durability test. But I do really like that. It's much nicer than the... Four, five, six, seven. Point... Five. Seven point five. All right. Mouthfeel. The added, mm, the added chocolatiness, the added dark chocolate over the top of, of the di standard digestive makes it way higher than a five, which is look what I've named previously, which is absolutely insane that how low that is. Um, is the digestive biscuit really that low? I must have in a bad mood that day. Um, but it is much nicer, it's one, six. Durability, like I said, crumbs everywhere, the same. It is no better, in fact, it's a bit worse. This could be a shocker. Uh, don't, in fact, I'm being a bit, I'm being a bit harsh on the texture, I think. No, 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 uh, maybe even the taste. No, no, I, you know what, I'm sticking with this. I'm sticking to my guns, everybody. Uh, dunkability, three seconds in, one. Two, three. Oh, I was, I was too, too keen. We're already getting a little bit of sag on here. What did we get? 8.5. Wow, okay. Let's see how this goes. One, two, three. Lift. 
I think we lost some of the biscuit in there. Oh no, we didn't. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. No, it's same biscuit, same biscuit. Okay, so that's pretty good. It survived too. It's not gonna go for triple on. It's melting on my fingers though. This is a, this is a messy biscuit actually. Mmm. I'm quite making a mess here. It's hard to hold for long divisions of time. Very similar. Is that is it so I need to do I need to put sweet meal here? Okay. It's just digest a sweet meal apparently. That makes a big difference. Alright, dunkability. It's the same again. No. Yep. Yep. Post on taste. Improved. Eight. Satisfaction, let's finish this bad boy. It's a fine biscuit. It's a satisfying biscuit. It's much better than the digestive on its own. But not, not that much better. Seven. No. Okay, so it's now not. Is it not? No, it's now not working out the algorithm for me, which is very annoying. Um, does anyone know how to do that? Somebody add up the scores for me. Math is not my strong point. I did copy and paste the cell. Didn't work. And also, I don't have a copy and paste. I can't do copy and paste because somebody stole my C key. Chief antagonist. Seven is the final, is the top score. Take paste the form from the above side. I did do that. Hey, there we go, it did it. Don't know why it took a while to do that. Sorry about that. 56, that's all right. Hold on, that's all right. Let's get things ordered. 56 is nice and high up there. It is matching with the rich tea. The rest of sweet milk biscuit. Osric, I do apologize for this. I feel very, very naughty here that I've absolutely, I feel like I betrayed you in some ways by having a sweet meal instead of a digestive biscuit, but I've, I've, I've put it specifically in there. So in future, I know when it's a proper digestive biscuit, we can make sure that it is correctly scored. Also it's Sainsbury's as well, so it's very different. Hmm. But there you go, look at that. Look at that. Are you all right, Osric? Are you okay? <sighs> I've literally no idea where he's gone with those keys and we've got an official live stream later on tonight. So I've got to go and hunt those down now. I suppose that'll be my next job for the day, uh, which is really fun. Uh, I need to increase my Excel skills. I know, uh, educating head Excel spreadsheet edition. Um, so, thank you very much for joining us here today, it's a lot of fun. Uh, tonight, if you are around 7pm BST, of course, we have a stream with uh, Sandro Samarco. Now that I'm on official work time, in about a minute's time I can start talking like this. Sandro Samarco is coming on and he's going to talk about the beta and about the feedback so far that we've had and about all the different changes that are coming and stuff like that. So, good stuff. Uh, thank you. I'm glad that it was more the fact that it fell apart and you gave it an 8.5 of dunkability. I don't think it did fall apart. I don't think it did. Sorry, Osri. We'll we'll talk afterwards. Send me a PM on on Twitter, and we'll we'll have a good chat about it. But you guys are the best. Thank you so much for um, for coming along again. Back tomorrow with some more jumping and some more tomfoolery 
and other silly things like that. And of course, more biscuit reviews. So let's see what tomorrow's biscuit can be. I will see you very soon. Thank you. Bye. Goodbye. Good evening. Afternoon. See you in a few hours time. See you. Bye.